All right, so um, I am just uh, recording this video to show uh, an issue I'm having. Not really an issue, but I'm trying to figure out a more efficient way to do what I need to do here. Basically, uh, let me just run through the, the game real quick. I, I made the levels really short so you can see what I'm doing. Um, so we basically have like a match three game. Um, you know, where you're required to have uh, certain flavors to get it to move along here. So, we'll complete the first level, and then we have effects here, level completed, the next level will come up, and we're doing the same thing here. Now, the issue I have is I have six cameras in this scene. And it's because of the different elements um, that I have coming up during the game. So I'll pause right here. Uh, so this is a good example. We have um, a background that's way the heck over here. I suppose I could move it. This is getting rendered first. Okay. This is getting rendered second. That's the, the shading right here. Um, and then we have the actual game I'm sorry the shaders here when I say shader it's just a uh, um, it's just a background to sort of make a little board in the background here again this is all programmer art um, and then we have these effects here which are actually in 3D so what's happening is you know we've got a bunch of different cameras GUI camera Fader camera, which is this black sort of, you know, when you fade in, fade out. Uh, cheer, which is the text that comes up in the middle. Um, background, which is this background that's way over here. Okay. And we also have an effects camera, which is for the stars that you see in the middle. And the main camera. So, um, I don't think this is probably the way it should be done. The reason I did this is because it was it, I felt like it was the only way I could really control the depth. See the depth 5, 3, 2, to really control what gets displayed at what time so they all line up on top of each other. So the, the, uh, I'm using NGUI and um, there's 2D elements and 3D elements being mixed together. So the effects are a 3D element, you know, they need to go behind uh, the cheer, which is a 2D element. So uh, that's the general idea, and I'm just looking for some help with that. So that's pretty much it. I'm going to stop the video now and uh, see if I get any responses. Thanks.